Hi everyone, this is Didi Nashik and I'm Keo. First, let me say happy Memorial Day. I'm just chilling at home. Um, yeah, happy Memorial Day. Um, I hope everybody's having fun being safe. And since I was just home, I was like, I might as well do my May favorites since May is pretty much over. Um, so I'll just get started on that. Oh, this is my same hair. I straightened it. I tried to do something different. Um, yeah. Okay, so I'll get started on my May favorites. First thing, I'll do my nail polishes first. Ooh, hair. First thing, what is this? Ooh, it's this OPI nail polish. It's Fiercely Fiona. It came out with the um, Shrek collection. I don't know. You can't really. I'll just put it on my finger. You can't really tell. You kind of have to build it up. I don't know. But I'm actually about to, as soon as I finish this video, I'm about to do my manicure in this color. I don't know. You can see it better than in the bottle. It's like a green. It's so pretty. It's like a good, really good summertime color. It's a weird green, but I like it. But yeah, so that's Fiercely Fiona. And then this is Essie, and it's the watermelon. And it looks, ooh, sorry, I'm gonna, It looks kind of orange. I mean, not orange. Oh my God, I meant red. I can't open it. Mm, I can't open it. It looks a little bit red, but it's not. It's like watermelon. It's like a dark pink. It's really cute. So those are my two. And I actually wear this one to my graduation. It was really cute in all the pictures. These are my two um, favorite nail polishes for me. Um, I don't really have a... Oh, this is... I have a couple other things. Okay. Um, as far as like makeup, I've been doing like minimal, 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 minimal makeup. Because um, I'm in St. Louis and it's so humid and it's so hot and I hate going outside and feeling like my makeup is melting and dripping off of my face like I hate that so I've really been doing like pretty much the least I can do to still like look fresh faced and whatever and like cute um but so yeah so I haven't really been doing like a lot of heavy eye makeup especially when I go out in the day but what I do use is a lot of mascara and this mascara has never failed me it's the Dior Show. Blackout. Look at the brush. See? Yeah. Look at that. It's crazy. And it gives you crazy length and crazy volume. And then I don't have to put on falsies when I use this. It's really good. It's really, really good. So I've been using that like all month. I actually need to go to Sephora and get another tube. Sorry, that's my mom screaming if you can hear that. Um, next thing I've been crazy about it's oh it's actually this fragrance and this is one of, I only have it in samples and I have another sample what is it called oh it's called pink sugar sensual and I actually got this at Norwich and the lady was like do you want to try samples me and my mom and she gave me like three or four samples this is I just wanted to keep this one wrapped because it's really cute it looks like a little candy you know how candy comes wrapped um it smells so good and it's so light it's like very like light romantic and like floral it's very like a summertime fragrance but this was really it smells so good so that's pink sugar essential and i think it's only available at nordstrom but i don't know um what else have i been like using like crazy um oh this feeling good tinted moisturizer for mac you actually can't tell this is a new container and I actually had to buy this online because it's from some collection I can't remember um, if I remember I'll put it like here but yeah it's the tinted lip condition it's all of them really good I have a bunch I have like the Hello Kitty ones I have pink fish like I like the pink colors it makes your lips look cute but these little tinted lip conditioners what is it yeah with SPF 15 bomb I've been using that like every day I have I carry pink fish around in my purse but this one I use like every day that I sit down and do my makeup I use that so that's what's up with that um what else Ooh, mm, this is probably my favorite 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 item I've been using it's MAC cream Bim, 
cream blend blush and it's optimistic orange and like i know you're probably looking at this like this is orange it is but once you like let me show you like that's how it comes can you see the color i don't know my computer's silly It kind of, you can't really tell the light in here is so retarded because it's so sunny outside. But, like, you have to, like, blend it out. So, like, if I blend it out, it's a really pretty, like, blushed, like, inner glow, beautiful look. And, like, I love it. It looks so natural. Like, it doesn't look like you're wearing blush. It looks like you just have, like, dewy, glowing skin. And that's what, like, I've really been getting into, like, cream blushes. And this was the first one I ever got. It was Optimistic Orange from MAC. But it is the bomb. And on my skin color, good. Like, you just, I you do it right with my hand. People say you can use, like, a um, stippling brush. But I do it, like, right with my hand. Like, right on. Been using that, like, every day. Um, what other thing? Oh, yeah. This. Then the last skin finish in brunette. And, like, I'm sorry. I hate doing this. I hate showing things that are, like, from collections that are no Like, it's, like, you can't find it anywhere anymore. Because that's annoying to me. Because I watch it. And I'm like, oh, like, she really likes this product. Um, maybe I should, like, get it. And then you can't get it. But this, I don't know. Like, I don't know what to say. Maybe a CCO might have it. But I use it so much. But I've been using the darker color. This is brunette MSF. This darker color. Just like right on my cheeks. Just to like give it like some. Just to give my face like color. Um, but something natural. Because I've told you I've been doing like minimal makeup. Because I don't want to sweat it off. And I don't want to look crazy. And I don't want to feel like. I, not even that I sweat it off. It just feels like it's coming off. And that. Oh, it, it, I hate that feeling. And this, like, if y'all knew St. Louis weather, y'all would understand exactly what I'm talking about. The humidity is disgusting. Oh my god. But yeah, so that's, I've been using my MSF in Brunette from the Brunette Blonde Redhead Collection. Yeah. The last thing that I've been, like, using like crazy Blot Powder from MAC. Now, you're not using blot powder and you live anywhere in like a humid climate like i don't know how you're surviving so like blot powder is great because it doesn't it's not designed to do anything but take the shine off your face this is my you can tell and this color is deep dark but like legit you just take it and you do this and you do this and you do this with the buff and it literally takes the shine off of your face and when i use when i find when i use mineral makeup it brings out a lot of the natural oils in my skin so it starts to look shiny after a little while i carry this in my purse everywhere i go do 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 blot nothing like it, it doesn't put on color it just takes the shine right out and i absolutely love it like this is a summertime must like if you don't have blot powder i don't know how you can live and wear makeup in the summer <laughs> like it's ridiculous but um yeah, so that's black powder, pressed powder from MAC. Um, deep dark is the color. That's about it. Those are my May favorites. Um, thanks for watching. Beauty and the Sheep.